So the YouTube and Sophie here, welcome back. Today's video is going to be my update, the first update for uh, Throwback 30. This was created by Jessica Lee. I will link her channel down below. And this is a fantastic ladies collab. I will also link the Facebook group in my description box. You are working on like one prompt, one prompt by project. 30 projects so I have 30 products in this um, uh, project um, this update though is going to be pretty quick because I'm not going to talk about the 30 products I have not been working on the 30 products in here um, also I'm filming filming it for the second time because the first time I forgot to well say the prompts so let's get into it Let's first start with 50 shades of pink. For that, I chose to roll in this face cream from Codexial. Codexial? Yes, Codexial. This is the Neolis 15 Emotion Micro Peeling. Yes, with 50% of glycolic acid. I have only used it three times, but um, this is kind of burning my skin um, not really the right term but I only have burning in my mind right now so uh, I, I don't know um, last year and uh, the beginning of this year I had two other face cream that were burning my skin and um, they were one was recommended by my dermatologist this one was recommended by my dermatologist at the end of my anti-acne treatment it's it's like a smoothing cream um but the other one my skin didn't like at all this like i said has glycolic acid the other one had uh, salicylic acid and like the two other cream that my skin wasn't liking were or well had like colic acid and I think I have tried another cleanser by the Inkylist which also had salicylic acid and my skin with the cleanser my skin was just ashy after a wash like completely dried out I've never seen it and with the cream one was just burning the other one was i i got like deep just painful pimples it was bad so my dermatologist uh, said that i my skin doesn't like salicylic acid so i have to be careful about that so even though this one burns i have used it three times like I said the first two times it burned but the third time it didn't so I'm going to use it a little bit more in September and we'll see but so far three uses and 1.92 grams used up so far next for 50 shades of yellow gold I have my double wear concealer as you can see, no yellow or no gold, but the original wand cap has uh, a gold cap. So, um, yeah, this uh, concealer, I panned it last year, but the applicator broke and I had to replace it with another, which is why the white cap, the black cap. Um, anyway, since the introduction, I have used it eight times, used up one gram and yeah this one is coming along I think I have like maybe 20 uses left so this one should be out of here pretty quickly then for beauty HZ I got the later K and I chose to roll in this lip gloss this is the Kiko Milano Jelly Jungle lip gloss in the color number two the goal is to finish uh, by the way the goal is to finish for the cream and the concealer too the goal is to finish. I have used it seven times since the last update, used up on 29 grams. And as you can see, I went from here to here. So I have maybe like 40 uses in here. Hopefully I can have this done pretty quickly because I do not enjoy this lip gloss anymore. 
which is sad because they used to be my favorites so yeah that's it for this one then i have child of the 80s and i've chosen this foundation this is the abh stick foundation in the color espresso the goal is to finish uh, so far i have used it four times and i forgot to mark it at the beginning but right now i am here which as you can see it's pretty good progress uh, this one was not brand new when i rolled in rolled it into this project but i have maybe used it once or twice so pretty much brand new if i continue to have this much progress maybe this one is not going to take me too long to finish it i have finished another stick foundation earlier this year it was painful to use because the shade was bad but um realistically i did not have to use it that many times to finish it so hopefully this one can be done pretty fast but I'm not focusing on it I'm focusing on another foundation so it's not going to go that fast next is going to be my longwear um, eye primer from Nocibe uh, which is the store brand the brand is the store is Nocibe this is the store brand um since the last update i have used it seven times which that means i've used well i've applied eye makeup seven times in a month that's not a lot but anyway um and i don't know the weights so far because i forgot to mark it in my list or i forgot to add it to my list of um product i'm panning on my computer so the way I, I don't know I have two lists I have one in my computer for the weight and one in notebook for the uses which is why you can see me in my videos looking down and looking to the I think it's going to be to the left for you so anyway this one is still here I mean I don't I don't have that much left but this is like at least half a year worth of eye primer um and the last product i want to talk about is this nail polish oh, it's so good let me shake it a little bit this is from ice cream nails and this is the nail polish mermaids made me you can see it on my nails in my previous video it's so beautiful i had to use the sponge method to have it really dense on my nails but i don't mind it i use it pretty much with every every glittery nail polish like 90 percent of my glittery nail polishes so it's just so good though my goal is to use it five times i have used it once so far um I'm, I'm i'm it's a pretty summery color i'm not sure if i'm going to have any more use soon um and also i have to focus on the, on the other not one other other nail polishes which my goal is to have done by the end of the year we are in september so i don't know if i'm going to have more use of this nail polish by the end of the year or well well at least in to, uh, until next spring but it's so good it's so beautiful so anyway that's it for today's update i hope you enjoyed it if you did don't forget to subscribe don't forget to check out uh the facebook group as well as the hashtag maybe if there's a hashtag i'm going to put it in my title but you can still search throwback 30 on youtube and you're going to see so many videos so I um, hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.